I'm gonna show you that one sexy thing that you must, must, must have in your wardrobe. Did I say must? Darling, fashion is broken. And that's why every six months, we must have it fixed. Oh, did you hear? Dorothy got fired today and it didn't even matter that she was doing the boss. <gasps> Break it down. Oh, 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 snap, snap. That one right there with the jerry curl. Oh yeah, that's mine. Y'all better back up. Hey baby, what's wrong with that one? Get his medication time! <laughs> All kidding aside, the LBD really does have multiple personality disorder, and that's a good thing. And I'm gonna show you why. Chic. Refinement. Sexy. Sleek. Stylish. Lovely. Sophisticated. Beauty. Black. Shoop noir, robe noir. Vestido negra pequeña. Little, little black, black dress. dress. The little black dress will take you throughout your entire life. And when you have doubts, you just go back to the little black dress and wear that and you'll be safe. Where do you wear the little black dress? You wear it to the meeting, you wear it to lunch with your girlfriends who are gonna dish you, mm -hmm. you wear it to a funeral. You wear it to a date. You wear it to a date. And if you're sexy, you take your little black dress, you put a fabulous little sexy heel, you go out on a date and you give the Audrey Hepburn vibe in the little black dress, which evolved into another style in the 60s with a Givenchy. And you don't say Givenchy. 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 I'm gonna break down LBDs for all body types. If you're curvy, what you wanna do with your little black dress is have a V-neck or a scoop neck that actually gives you length and accentuates your curves in a really nice way. If you're top heavy, meaning have bodacious ta-tas, you can get a peplum, which is just a little mini skirt thing that flares out. You can put that over your little black dress, make sure that the hem is the same length as your black dress or a little bit longer, and it gives you a little pow at the bottom to match your pow at the top and accentuates the uh of the waist in the middle. Chanel invented it in 1926. It was a liberation moment for fashion. Free the woman! She took them out of their corsets and their stays and hooks, and she gave them modernity. She is arguably the most important person in fashion. It's and awesome. you don't call her Coco. If you really are respectful, you call her Gabrielle. And if you really know her, what's up, Gabby? <laughs> okay, so this is Jane. And Miss Jane is dressed a little plain for work, but she met a boy a couple of days ago. She has a date with him tonight, but she doesn't have time to go home. So what does Jane do? Jane goes to the bathroom after work, loses the jacket, bam, throw on a cuff, bam, statement necklace, bow, and throw some blonics on those feet, yeah. I call it clock out to knockout. Yeah. Little, black. don't. I had a black dress moment, Andre. Really? That was one of the most fashion don'ts of my okay. entire life. <laughs> Let's see. It was mid 90s. I felt hot, sexy. Mm -hmm. I thought my abs were doing good. And this is what I did at an award show. Baby! Oh my God. Recatee. What were you thinking with a bra and skirt? Where was you going? I don't know, it's Yenna almost Ford. like you were going to Antigua for a little calypso <laughs> dancing. This is the ultimate little black dunk. <laughs> Jumpsuit. I have so much more to share and teach and show and have fun with you, but I gotta get to know you better. So please go to the Just For You section and tell me all about you so that I can give you personalized information that suits only you. I'll share more if you share more.